Hey, what's up, guys? Now, today, I have a little bit of a breaking news, and this do have to do with Apple. You may know or you may not know that Steve Jobs did step down as CEO for Apple, and Tim Cook is going to take the position of CEO. Now, this is such breaking news because Steve Jobs was, like, pretty much the front man for Apple. He led Apple into the right direction for so many years. And even when he take a leave of absence, people say that the company go down this a little because he don't have that input anymore. But he would still be the chairman of Apple and everything and still be on the board of directors because he do have a majority share of the company. I still I still think so, but I'm not sure on that one. But him as not CEO, he won't have as much control, but he have a little bit of control of the day-to-day -day operations of Apple, but not too much because he will no longer be CEO. Now, this news saddened me because um, I love Steve Jobs and I love Apple. I have a MacBook Pro, iPod Touch, not an iPhone yet because I don't get the iPhone 5. But Steve Jobs is really this the main person of Apple. When you thought of Apple, you thought of Steve Jobs and him not being the front runner of it. Now when you think of Apple, what you gonna think of? I doubt it if it's Tim Cook. So what I say, I say this company is if, if Tim Cook do a good job, I say this company is gonna stay at the same level it is. But I say one slip up but from Tim Cook, I say the company is gonna go downhill. And maybe another big tech company that make computers will step up and make some great computers like Apple. So who knows what's going to happen in the next couple of years or even the next couple of months. I guess we will see that in the next couple of months. So that's, yeah, that's it, guys. I just want to explain about CJ stepping down as CEO. And yeah, this is just a little short video. All right, guys, leave your comments on thoughts in the comments below. All right, guys, bye.